Hey guys and welcome to Words of Scale. So this is going to be one of those short and sweet and that's another, <laughs> that's what she says reference that uh, very few people caught uh, last time. So this is going to be a short and sweet video about the topic that we rarely talk about here on this channel, which is monetization and three trends that I'm seeing for the past year and they are only getting worse that prompted me to I recorded this video are as follows. So the review types of blogs are losing rankings. And this is because uh, giants like Amazon are taking over. And so are the DA90 review blogs and tech blogs. Informational content uh, requires a lot of page views to make money. I had one subscriber approach me. I think the estimate, the rough estimate for him to make a decent amount of money was a hundred thousand page views for his niche. And uh, what makes matters even worse is that uh, many bloggers, especially newbie bloggers, they can get uh, their blogs up and running, but they are terrible in monetizing the existing traffic. So all of these prompted me to think of a prompt <laughs> that would take your existing niche, your existing keywords, and think, help you uh, think outside of the box and suggest you five different ways to monetize that article, that niche, that keyword, depending on what you are going to input. So this is a giant prompt. And again, for those of you playing at home, I will not be <laughs> pasting that prompt under the description. This is for my patrons only. They have a luxury of just copying and pasting my prompts, but I am not hiding my prompts. You can pause the screen and write it down. It's only, it's only going to take you one minute or so. So please, guys, be sensible about that. Man has to eat, <laughs> so to speak. So I will go over this giant prompt. And uh, I, I'm i not sure I'm the only one, but I'm probably one of the few YouTubers that are using the so-called sequential or, or sequence prompts. So I want you to run three steps in a sequence, one by one. This is the start of the prompt. Step one, I want you to, pre to pretend to be an experienced salesperson who understands human nature, sees their pain points even if they don't, and is capable of coming up with creative ways to sell and always uh, closes. Do you understand? Step two, below are the examples of a logic used by an experienced salesperson on how to sell products or services based on the given search. And here I give four different examples of how you can use one niche and product and turn it into something else. So if a person is interested in how to turn on the AdSense, you can sell hosting services. If you, if a person is inquiring about can frogs, <laughs> that's a new one, can frogs hit bananas. Um, if the person is acquiring about the docs, you can sell pet insurance. If you are thinking about the guest, guest prices and looking for guest prices online, there is a credit card with the guest rewards. If you are looking for a fire alarm, uh, you can uh, sell house insurance to that person. So this is the second part of the prompt and uh, ask GPT if uh, it understands. Then the third part is based on the above logic, make five suggestions of additional products and services that can be offered to someone interested in the topic that I will ask you to make a suggestion on. So we'll just run this prompt now. Yes, I understand, please proceed with the topic. And I'll be using different examples uh, from niches that I've seen online, from my own niches. So let's just uh, start with something very uh, informational. And this came from uh, Marcus Campbell, who runs the Affiliate Dude YouTube channel. So I think in one of his older videos, he mentioned a person who approached him asking uh, how he could monetize a how to tie a tie keyword. And I don't remember the exact response, but Marcus said something along the lines of it is difficult to monetize, but I can do it. So how to tie a tie. Based on the logic provided, here are the five suggestions. Men's clothing and accessories, online fashion courses, personal styling services, YouTube tutorials and instructional videos and tie clips and other accessories. So accessories is mentioned two times, but this, uh, the top one is in conjunction with men's clothing, and this is just about the tie clips. Okay, and this is um, me revealing one of my niches, but oh well. 
What about how to know if I am underpaid? So this is a purely informational keyword. Based on the logic provided here are five suggestions, salary benchmarking tools, career coaching services, and whenever it mentions tools, you need to pay very close attention because this is what will make your existing articles helpful with the help of ChatGPT and some basic coding. So this is another very informational keyword. Let's uh, try to think of something else. Okay, how about how did Elon Musk become successful? Again, purely informational. There are a lot of sites. There are lots of sites about celebrities and success stories and whatnot. Based on the logic provided here, are five suggestions: and entrepreneurship courses, biographies and books, technology and innovation workshops mentorship programs, personal development and self-improvement tools. So again, I'm not saying this is genius advice, but this is just to get you out of the rut. If you are thinking, I have an informational content and I need 100,000 page views to make some money. No, you don't. You can use these and look for affiliate programs or create your own informational and digital products. So let's try the, the last one. Okay. How about, and these are all existing keywords, how to stop yelling in a relationship. So that's going to be the last one for today. Based on the logic provided, here are five suggestions. Anger management courses, couples counseling services, communication workshops, stress management tools, life coaching services, and in one of my generations, I got a meditation apps suggestion, which is very valuable as well. Okay, what about this? This one actually just I just thought about it, and I used to be in that niche. Also, how about book summaries? Book summaries, reading clubs, audio summaries, so Audible. Online courses on speed reading, interesting. <laughs> Books recommendation services. Oh, that's, that's actually quite interesting. Personal open and self improvement book tools. So, if you're uh, talking about the specific types of books, here I did not specify what books I'm talking about, but if it's uh, books about self development, you can offer personal development and self development tools. So this is it. The prompt is going to be in the prompts library, guys. <laughs> Once again, you can pause the screen and write this down. And hopefully this was helpful. Like, share and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you next time.